Okay, so now that we're done reading our pages, we're going to find an example for coming of age again so that we can balance out our evidence that we have from the text so far. So I'm thinking about page 114. Uh, this is a page where she's really thinking about her identity and how her experience fits the definition of a normal life. So as we read through this section again, we're looking for literary elements that are evident. So here she says, so if there if I have a fantasy, it'd be how I look. Miss Rain say I'm beautiful like I am. Where, how, to who? So if you notice, she's got this repetition going and um, she really is repeating this question-like attitude. Um, even down here, she says, what is a normal life? So as for literary element, the best one that fits in this example would be repetition because she is repeating this uh, question like structure. So let's go ahead and copy down those lines. So for our quote, we're gonna write page 114. And then we're gonna go ahead and write down those questions. Where, how, to who. Notice I'm using the ellipses, the dot, dot, dot to continue uh, with that space in between finishing off our quote with what is a normal life. Next is our context. So we just need to explain what exactly is happening in this part of the story. So Precious is reflecting on her identity. Precious is reflecting on her identity and how her experience compares to the definition of a normal life. And how her experience compares to the definition of a normal life. So now we need to do our analysis. Um, we'll copy down our sentence starter from our connection to theme box. And that's what we'll start with here. So first let's explain how this is an example of repetition. And we can argue that this is an example of repetition because the author repeats the sentence structure or syntax is another way to explain that with questions. So the author repeats the sentence structure or syntax with questions. So how do these repeating questions connect to our understanding of the theme? How do these repeated questions connect to what we know already about the author's message on coming of age? So if we wanna scroll up and check what we wrote before, from our simile box, we said coming of age is a challenge and should be expected as such. So we can argue here that it's a challenge for Precious to understand who she is and that her life isn't going to be normal. Neither is anyone's life going to be normal. Um, coming of age is about the challenge. So there is nothing normal per se about that. It will be a struggle. So we can argue it supports the theme because it mirrors the idea that coming of age doesn't fit the expectation of, quote, normal, because since it will always be a challenge for people to identify who they are overcome obstacles. As 
was seen by Precious. Good questions. Everything about her life. So again, we have coming of age doesn't fit the expectation of normal. Coming of age doesn't fit the expectation of normal since it will always be a challenge for people to identify who they are and overcome obstacles. Since it will always be a challenge for people to identify who they are and overcome obstacles as seen by Precious who questions everything about her life. 